Welcome back to Rocket City. I'm still a little bit bitter we're sitting at number two, especially with freaking Notre Dame at the top. They become the nemesis of the series. Like, we beat their butts last year, and they still made the playoff over us. This year, we gotta take care of business. And really, the sidebar of this season is gonna be me chasing that Heisman with two guys, and maybe even three if Beef Wellington keeps up his tremendous play. Brandon Ford and Tim Missile just keep carrying the team. Well, this week, we're going on a road trip to Mississippi. We're gonna be playing Ole Miss and Mississippi State in this episode. Powder Blues. I do dig their jerseys, but I don't dig the weather we're playing in right now. Hopefully this rain turns into a bunch of turnovers on the opposite side. And that Tim Missile can fall on those fumbles. Still chasing that Heisman. Yep, slap the bald head. Not a tradition I'm familiar with, but hey, everyone's got their own weird tradition here in college football. Big run on the first play. Beef Wellington has to hawk him down. Oh, blocked. Another big run. He's breaking a tackle. Traverius Ward gets blocked. Tim Missile, you're the last line of defense. Grabs his ankles, but he's in for the touchdown. Man, it only took him two plays to score. That was some sloppy defense. Gotta wake up. We can't let that happen. We're the number two team in the country. Don't want to slip up against an old Miss. Ooh, number 12, Texas Falls. More top teams. If they keep losing, it's extra insurance that we make the playoff. Oh? Carlson, doing your thing? He's still going? All right, that's a lot of movement for only 25 yards. I'm going to drop it short. And that's Jacob Smith for the first down. Wayne Fontenot this year has really felt like our Stetson Bennett. Not trying to be a hero or anything. Just make a few throws a game like that. And that's good enough. Give me that crack block. Oh. Stiff arm him. Come on. There we go. First down. Tough to bring down. This one's for Tyreek. And he's going to be going down way in the backfield. Taking a tough hit. Oh, you forgot about Tim Missile. He's wide open. Just because he's a defensive player doesn't mean he can't catch passes. That's going to be the easiest touchdown of his career. Just walking it in. Oh, wait. Why was Florida ranked to begin with? They were 2-2, two and two, and now they're 2-3. and three. Keep him in front of you. Oh, Tim Missile got just thrown to the dirt. That's a vicious stiff arm from Jason Murray. Okay, they've run it every single play. We're fully committing to this. And we still can't get there. Man, they are tearing us apart. Engage 8. Let's see if it works. Oh, wow. Look at those blocks downfield. I mean, they're holding everybody on the line. Tight ends and wide receivers downfield are killing us, too. Let's stay at home a little bit. Quarterback keeper. He still got it. Oh, my, how did he break that? Touchdown. Back-to-back -back drive. They've just run it down our throats. And we're missing tackles. See if I can't fool him with a read option here. They'll never think Wayne's going to be running it. Just kidding. It's going to Brandon Ford. And that'll give him a chunk of eight. Oh, they got through. Fourth and one. We got to go for it here. Come on. I'm giving it to the beef tank again. It worked against Alabama. Let's see if it can work here against Ole Miss. Lowering the shoulder, and he's just too heavy. They can't bring him down. I'm just going to scramble out with Tyreek. He's great at doing this. Goes around a man. And that's a massive gain of 32. There you go, Tyreek. Oh, Tim Missile open again. I mean, he's so efficient out there. What, he lead us in receiving yards last game? He might do it again here today. And off Jordan Vaughn. Oh, that's a sick juke move. Stunned the safety right in his spot. Man, if he was our full-time guy, I think he might be up for the Heisman as well. He is such an explosive player. It's weird. Brandon Ford is the leader for the Heisman on our team, but Jordan Vaughn might be a better running back than him. Will he pitch it forward? He did, and it's going to hit the turf. That's going to be an incomplete pass, technically. It looked like a fumble on my screen. Okay, now he's passing it. He's got a guy to that outside. I can't reach for it, but you saw me in the range. Tim Missile was trying to hunt him down. Wasn't even his zone, too. He was just trying to make up for the team's mishaps. Pitches it. All right, I'm going all the way back. I got the tackle. Oh, my gosh. He's already got 125 rushing yards. This guy is smoking us. Just look at the blocks. I mean, we can't break anything open. This is going to be such a high-scoring game if we can't slow them down. Just a bit offside, <laughs> and he still makes it. Holy crap. I don't even know how that's possible. This game's kind of goofy sometimes. What the? What just happened? Come on, Carlson. You can't even catch the fair catch. Screen. All right, give me those blocks downfield. There we go. That'll be a first down. Way to hold on, guys. Come on. Our right, nice broken tackle and the pitch. And he's given the block. Look at that effort from Tyreek. And Brandon Ford might go the distance. Oh, inside the five. Damn. What an effort from Tyreek. Breaks the tackle right here. So that way he can still hold on and pitch it. Pitches it. And then he runs up. Speeds up to block the man in front of him to extend the play even farther. The hero of that play. And that's no doubt. 
Jordan Vaughn. Oh, and he's going to get a second rushing touchdown of the game. Brandon Forward's too tired to punch this one in, but we'll take it. All right, I'm blitzing him. Oh my god, he got absolutely bodied. You could just feel that anticipation coming. Tim Missile around the corner. An absolute explosion on the lad. I really feel like they're gonna be throwing it here. Oh, they're actually gonna be running it, but Tim Missile gets the TFL anyway. Right into the corner of him. Tight end open again. Tim Missile, he's holding on to it through contact as well. He's just a talented football player. Tim Missile again. I'm just looking at him every single time. He's breaking tackles after it too. Oh, they left him open. What are they thinking? Tim Missile's just going to shoot up the gap. No safeties there. Is he faster than 35? He is not, but that is a massive gain. Hit him again. I mean, we just targeted him the entire way down the field. He was always open, and this man did not drop a single pass. Formations all over the place, too. Tim Missile is truly a multi-talented weapon. Two touchdowns on this game for him, making that Heisman resume look nicer every single week. We knew it was going up the middle, and they're still going to get the first down, though. Mistakes by me. Oh, we sent the engage eight, and it worked. And that's going to be tying the school record for sacks in a season. And we're only six games in. He's chasing the entire NCAA record for sacks in a season. Give me that block pullback. There we go. Ryan Brown, nice job on the edge. And that'll get a 16. Can you throw the dime? Oh, Jacob Smith. That's a great catch. Oh, easily making a great grab, too. These receivers are balling out in this game. I know you're tired, Brandon Ford, but we got to get you these touchdowns. The things we do to get the Heisman Trophy, and he's there. There we go. He's been efficient on the ground today, but that is his first touchdown of the day. So we've been cooking here in this first half, and the defense is finally showing up. But now that it is halftime, let's hear from today's NIL sponsor, Squarespace. Squarespace is an all-in-one platform to create a beautiful website and run your business. They have countless best-in-class website templates, and you can customize them to fit your needs. For me, I built a website for the RCU Football Season Ticket Club. This is a space for the fans of the Moon Mint to interact amongst themselves. And thanks to Squarespace, they have access to features like threaded comments, replies, and likes. It was pretty easy for me to build. Squarespace has a bunch of easy templates I can choose from, and you don't have to be an expert to make a beautiful website in just a few minutes. And with Squarespace, I can check analytics to see how many people visit the site and figure out which channels are most effective. I'm also able to embed third-party videos on Squarespace so we can see all the highlights from the games on Saturday and seeing all the fan reactions to seeing a wide-open receiver and a missed read. What you should do is take advantage of my special offer right now and use my custom link in the description below at squarespace.com slash not the expert where you're going to get 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Once again, take advantage of my special offer right now and use my custom link in the description below at squarespace.com slash not the expert for 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Thanks again to Squarespace for sponsoring Rocket City and this video. This one's for Adam Coles. Oh, look at this hole. I might just keep it with Tyreek. And Tyreek's going. That's another big gainer for him. He has been awesome at the option offense. We got Tim Missile at another tight end position. This one is like a little outpost action. Oh, and look at the block. That's going to be an... Oh, Ryan Brown. This is a hit piece. This is like what happened last year in the bowl game. He made the block and then he turned around and just hit Tim Missile out of bounds. What the hell? What the... <laughs> What's the deal with that? First and second down goes to Brandon Ford. Third down will go to Tim Missile. Right, Jordan Vaughn's on the field. Never mind. He'll run this one. He's so quick. Maybe this is a Beef Wellington. Let's keep Beef Wellington in this too. That's what I'll do. If we're this close, it's going to Beef. He's so good at these. Oh, he gets stuffed. Run it back. They can't deny him twice. Give it to him again. And they stuff him again at the one. Damn it. They knocked the guy over, but he held on for dear life. Like I'm telling you, if they try to throw a pass, Tim Missile is going to clean it up. Oh, it's a QB keeper. Third and 10 at the one. This is our chance for the safety. They're keeping the fullback out. I'm sending Tim. I can't get through. Oh, it's at the one again. Can we block the punt, maybe? This is as close as you will ever get, Tim. This is your chance. Become the Heisman. Let's do this. Oh, I thought I had it. Damn, that's as close as we'll ever get. How close was Tim Missile, you say? That freaking close. Let's pull it back. Oh, did it go through his fingers? Did we get robbed by the game? Yep. All right, Tim Missile got absolutely robbed. He blocked a punt. It's cannon. It didn't happen on the field, but we see the evidence right here. Tim Missile is the GOAT. This one's going to Tim Missile then. We'll just get a touchdown right here on the next play. If he can't do it on the punt, he'll do it as a tight end. Third receiving touchdown of the game. What a beautiful route. That kind of acceleration is deadly both on defense and offense. Oh, just stuffed. Ryan Hawkins was unblocked. 
He's got nowhere to go with it. That's going to be a sack. Yeah, I was going to say, if he did throw it, Tim Missile was going to take that the other way. Great sack for Beef Wellington. We've seen a lot of the other two quarterbacks, Wayne Fontenot and Greg Williams, but we haven't seen a lot of Ryan Vincent this year. Let's see what he's got here in this blowout game. This one's just going to be a check down to the tight end, and that's going to be a first down. Way to go through the reads. Throwing the dart. Tyreek. He holds on to it. That's going to be a first down. Trusting in your receiver. Oh, and Tim's going to reach out there and get that football. 187 receiving yards, and he's like a part-time offensive player. That is what's crazy about it. Like, he is so talented. I can just remotely look his way and just click the button, and he's going to get the football. Ryan's doing a little scramble here. Get it to Tim Missile. Oh, that's going to be not a first down, but that's the 10th catch of the game for Tim. Just dominance. Go out wide, Tim. I'm throwing it to him, giving him a chance, and that's going to be turnover on downs. He was literally like quadruple covered. Look at this. <laughs> They're like, you're not getting this ball. Hey, but this is even better. Chance for the safety again. I'm here for it. Oh, we're going to get the safety. It's not going to be for Tim Missile, but Rocket City's going to take it home with that. Tim Missile. Thought he was going to be good at offense, but he is unbelievable. He is just such a dangerous weapon. 10 catches, nearly 200 receiving yards, and three touchdowns. Stats on the game. Wayne was lighting up the scoreboard, but trust me, he wasn't as impressive as the stat line shows. Brandon Ford had another 100 rushing yard game. Jordan Vaughn kind of stole his touchdowns from him, but Jordan Vaughn is just that good. Cyric Parrish got 92 rushing yards as well. Nice to have him as our option quarterback. And Tim Pistol. I mean, he's the best player in the entire country, and I don't think it's much debate. Can we get him that Heisman? Because it's so easy to feed him the ball. 10 catches, 197 receiving yards, three touchdowns this game at the tight end position. And on the defense, he got himself another sack in this game and four TFLs, eight total tackles. Hey, we got ourselves a recruit, another running back added to our already talented roster. Oh, and we get ourselves an instant commit. Mark Logan, the number five punter in the nation. Man has 93 kick power. That is nice. And what's interesting is we might get the number one punter in the country as well, but now we don't need him necessarily. Now, as long as we get this wide receiver, our team needs will be met. Mr. Scott Carr, the number four athlete in the country, five star. His ball carrier vision needs some work though, but the elusiveness and the juke and spin move look nice. Oh, and I just realized we're the number one team in the country. How about that? Suck on that, Notre Dame. It looks like they lost to UNC who shot all the way up to number two. And there's only two remaining undefeated teams in the country. We are one of them. Baylor sitting there at number three. That is great news for us. Checking out the Heisman's standings. Oh, wow. Brandon Ford just completely dropped off the list. Tim Missile is sitting at number three. And Drake May, he looks like a threat. He's already got 29 touchdowns, one interception. But the resume of Tim Missile, we're going to keep building on it, try and get some interceptions this year. We haven't got a single one. That's because I've been rushing the passer. But the receiving has been nice. 19 catches, 349 yards, and four touchdowns. Ooh, they got a 97 overall quarterback. It seems like we're going against talented quarterbacks every single week. But now we're going for that big time game. we got to try and get that high and trophy. Tim Missile, he will be playing a lot more tight end, but Brandon Ford, he's going to get some rushing touchdowns here today as well. So throw away your stupid cowbells, Mississippi State. I'm trying to put up 50 on you. Oh, Tim Missile is wide open. Could this be a big play for him? Yes, it is. Up to the 30-yard line. 45-yard reception already. I mean, he just keeps winning the big plays. Brandon Ford hasn't broken off one in a while, so I think we're going to have to commit to Tim. Off of his back foot, and that's a pick. What the hell, Wayne? Well, it's going to be another tackle for Tim Missile. Just not on the side of the ball that we want it to be. Screen pass. Oh, and Tim Missile gets another tackle. They've only run one offensive play, and he's already got two tackles. Man is hacking the game. Breaks off of it. And way to fight at the ball. Traverius Ward. Great pass deflection. Oh. Oh, nice blocks. Brandon Ford, that's the kind of explosive plays we've been needing from you. We're heaving it to the end zone. Tim Missile 1v1. Oh, and he's going to win that battle. That is sick. We ran a screen pass and said, you know what? F it. We're throwing it down there. Tim Missile's down there somewhere. That is awesome. 1v1 with the safety. This man is 6'8". You're not going to win that battle. Ooh, North Carolina on upset alert. Just not even a chance. Tim Missile has his handprints all over this game. Going around this side. Oh, take a sack as well. A TFL, a sack, a touchdown deep to him. Like, what more do you want? He's an electric football player. Are they going to try and do this again? Tim Missile just deep. You got linebackers on him. What a freaking joke. Look at him toast him. Let me throw it over the top. Oh, and he's got it. It was overthrown to Tim Missile. Back to the end zone. He's just putting on a show. This might be his Heisman game. And he's already had a game where he had nearly 200 receiving yards. Stretching out for it. That is awesome. Oh, it's a screen. 
Oh, and the quarterback can't even get the pass off because Tim Missile is already flying back in there. Oh, whoa, that is violent. Flipping the man forward. Pitches it, but that one's on the ground for the defense. Brandon Ford not able to recover in time. Touchdown, Mississippi State. Yeah, done did it, Wayne. Send it. Uh, yikes, poor lad, every time. Oh, straight at Clifford. Why did he decide to tackle the guy? You could have got the pick. Going underneath. Oh, that's smart. Montrell, can you tackle him for me? There we go. This is what happens when I sell out like this. Trying to hit the quarterback, sending a lot of pressure, and we don't get through. They will get a ton of yards. Fully committing to that run up the middle. Oh, and he makes a nice throw. We had a guy there. I can't believe he didn't see him behind him. This is another Tim Missile play. If I can get time to throw it. Hey, he wasn't even open anyway. We would have been picked. So Wayne had to take another sack. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Blown coverage. Tim Missile's going to have to get him. Oh, he's wide open. And Ward is not going to make the tackle. We have lost the lead. We messed around, and now we're finding out. Let's roll with this formation for the memes. Give me time. 1v2. And that's going to be a pick. Worst play of the day by far. Our meme offense is not working, and I think we need to change it back. Montrell gets toasted. We're going to be down by two touchdowns. Oh, how did we get here? All right, we've been falling asleep at the wheel. We need to wake up. I got to do better as a play caller and figure it out. I hear everyone in the comments run the dang ball, and that's what I shall do. Great pitch. Oh, and we can't even complete the pitch. What is going on? We got the yips. I'm going back to beef here. I need this first down. We need the spark to get back in this game. Oh, and he's bulldozing. Still going. That's a gain of 12. Going to Tyreek on the sidelines, and he got out of bounds. Great. So Tyreek in at quarterback. Oh, what a great route from Ryan Brown. That'll put us in the red zone. We do have one timeout in our pocket, so I'm going to keep trying to run plays here. Going up the middle, Aaron Gibson. Breaking a tackle. That's great. That'll save us some time. We can run a play, maybe. It's got to be quick. We'll just stick with this one and try and get it. Hit him again. Touchdown. There we go. Shout out to Aaron Gibson for getting us that first. Trusted in my team to get that touchdown, too, instead of settling for the three. So that'll keep it at a one-score game going into halftime. Get that running back, maybe? Or the corner route's just wide open. Damn, it's torching us. That's covered up, but he found the other guy. Damn, this quarterback is good. Leaving guys wide open to blitz, and he's got a first and goal. Watch the short stuff and touchdown. We're falling apart. Oh, he got the angle on me. I couldn't pitch it. Wayne, we need to have a talk. You're getting benched for that throw alone. We can't even complete a screen pass. We can like Zach Wilson out here. Push him back. There we go, Montrell. That's going to be like near the one yard line. Can we get the sack? He is going to throw it. He might have a guy and swat it away. Third and 13. I'm sitting up in my seat because we got a chance. They are going to throw it. Pressure's not there. And he's actually going to get the first down. Tackle him, and he's going to be short of it. Great blocks from everybody. Got to break those tackles, though. He really hasn't shown me too much today, unfortunately. Oh, there, except for that one. That was good. Might be some Jordan Vaughn time. We need some explosive runs, and not like the ones you get after Taco Bell. One quarter left to play. We have a lot of work to do. Down by 14. Perfect season on the line. Coming around the edge. Ah, oh, Wilkerson saved me. This guy is dotting us up. 307 yards, four touchdowns. He's going to try and scramble. Tim Missile trying to recover. Can't make the tackle. This quarterback is insane. Look how beefy he is. Those arms. To the corner. What a dime. I just don't know how to stop this quarterback. He is so good. Five touchdowns, only four incompletions. Now it's looking like it would have to be just an insane comeback down. 21 points here in the fourth quarter. Quickly get this one out. Ryan Brown first down. That'll stop the clock for a moment. All right, in motion. I got to take a chance on you, Ryan Brown. Oh, up the second chance. He doesn't grab it. Come on, fourth and ten. Oh, did we catch him off sides? Got to throw it on the run. Jacob Smith. That'll be a first down. That one was close. Five minutes left to go. We got to score quicker than this. We're calling in the trick plays. Great pass from Jordan Vaughn. Great moves from Brandon Ford. The trick play. 
It's gonna get a touchdown. Let's freaking go. When we needed something to happen, call in the trick plays. One running back throwing to another running back, and he's gonna take it the distance. Oh, in the backfield. There we go. Four and a half minutes. We can still do this. All right, Tim Missile must be deathly tired because we're playing him too much on offense. He's throwing it across the middle and another first down. We're falling apart. Safety blitz. He's got that tight end. That has been his safety valve all game long. Another first down three minutes ago. They're trying to milk the clock now. I can't burn timeouts just yet. We have to get the stop here on this specific drive. This set of downs, we need to make it happen. Draw play. There you go, Doug Mayfield. Where is Tim Missile is the question on everyone's mind. Push him back, Beef. Push him back. And that's picked off by Nate Woods. Perfect. They don't get a field goal or anything. All right, we can go. Oh, but they have no safeties back. This is perfect for us. I think Brandon Ford beat him. Oh, diving catch. Hell yeah. All right, we got this. One minute, 16 seconds. I'm hitting the tight end. Get the first, Aaron. Stop in the clock. That's good. Tyreek on the comeback and he's in there for the touchdown and we still have all three timeouts if we get a stop here We're still in this game. All right. No fooling around. We've made a ton of mistakes today But we have a chance to clean it up here right up the middle get there. There we go. That's a big play from Alfred Clifford They're running it He's short of it fourth and inches. Oh my god. We're hanging on by a thread. We have a long way to go though So I'm gonna trust in the trusty four verts and I think I see him, Ryan Brown, on the first play. Go, go, go. Get there. All right, at the 20. We are in the hurry up the rest of the way. We have no timeouts. Throwing it to him, Tyreek. Get in the clutch. He's there. Let's go. Oh, my God. What a game. A strike from Greg Williams, who has shown he can be clutch. I think I might just have to make him the full-time starter after this. He had this kind of clutch play against Alabama, and now he's doing it here against Mississippi State. I thought about going for two here, but I think we are the better team. We can beat them in overtime. Sick stuff, man. What are the greatest comeback I've ever seen. 21 points in six minutes. Now, what we do need to do is move back. Do not let them get a field goal. And they're going to run it here on this first play. Are they just trying to go to overtime? They're too afraid. Taking their sweet time. Wow, they're going to let it tick down, aren't they? One last play. He's scrambling. He's got no time in the clock. We just have to tackle him. He slides. What an idiot. All right, we're going to overtime. And we win the toss. We're going to go defense first. So we know what we have to do on offense. If you've been watching this series, our track record in overtime is not great. So I want to win this one here. And we're already getting a TFL. Those backup linebackers are stepping up. All right, Wilkerson, watch that corner out. This tight end is what I'm really worried about. They're running a screen pass. Okay, third and five. This is stoppable. Screen. Everybody commit to it. Thankfully, we got smart players who are on top of that all day. And he drills it. So we need a touchdown and we win the game. North Carolina officially loses. Going back to running the football after all that craziness. Great blocks on the outside. Great moves from Brandon Ford. We're almost there. Keep running those pitch plays. Oh, nice. Fullback has the block. Brandon Ford sees the end zone. See you later, Cowbell. Mississippi State is going down after one of the greatest comebacks in channel history. Greg Williams, you have been awarded the full-time starter position. Brandon Ford, great catch there late in the game. And we finally win an overtime game. It feels so good. Brandon Ford grabs player of the game. Four catches, 124 receiving yards, and of course, a touchdown. That one feels good. Final score, 48 to 45. But the real question is, what the hell happened to Tim Missile? Stats on the game. Greg Williams, he actually outproduced Wayne Fontenot in only like a few quarters of play. I just think he's the better player. He's come up in the clutch. Wayne, we've already seen him at his ceiling and he's got glass bones, man. He gets hurt every other game. Brandon Ford, we're not forgetting about you, lad. Kind of a tough game early on, but you managed to finish it out strong. Tim Missile led us in receiving yards again. Four catches, 156 yards, two touchdowns. Tyreek Parrish, two touchdowns there in the fourth quarter to try and tie it up. That was awesome. Brandon Ford had a great catch downfield as well. I was loving that. Tim Missile got two more sacks on his total for the year. Hopefully he's healthy and everything's okay. Hopefully he was just kind of tired and needed some Gatorade. 630 yards of total offense for us. I mean, we got yards. We just couldn't finish it off. We turned the ball over a lot. Four turnovers, not ideal. But hey, we got the win. Wow, the new rankings. We are at number one, Baylor number two, Alabama at number three. I think I agree with those rankings. Notre Dame can eat it though. Brandon Ford back on the Heisman watch. Tim Missile stayed at number three, even though he missed like the second half of that game. But Drake may 
Hey, still at the top. He's gonna be a tough one to dethrone. Well, that's pretty much all I got for this video. I wanna say thank you guys so much for watching. You're all legends in my book, and as for me, I am Drew Morris, big old Drewski, not the expert. And I'll see all you guys in my next video. Peace. Thank you to Patreon supporters Christian Tag, Jack Webb, Matt Woodruff, Anthony Uhas, Jeff Coleman, Hagen Webster, Jacob Jordan, Timbo Slice, Tyler Cracker, Casey Knox, Austin Gazzetti, Rosalie Jarecki, Demondre Hunter Martin, Seth Washburn, and Latrell Lee.